Place wise, it feels to be a Blackburn player. Feels feels good at the moment. It's, uh, I've been welcomed like amazingly. Uh, the people at the club have just greeted me with open arms. It's been it's been quality from right down from. Sorry, Ben, I've had a problem. Sorry, Kizzy. No problem. We'll just go again then. Yeah. Take two. Take two, yeah. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> How does it feel to be a Blackburn player? Uh, it feels it feels great. Um, I've been welcomed with massive open arms. Um, right down from the press men to the kit man, all the way up to directors, you know. Um, everything's been great at the moment. What was it that attracted you to the move? Uh, first of all, uh, yeah, the project, you know, what's going on here, I think the intentions of the club, the way the club's looking to go forward, the signings that the club's made, um, it was definitely a positive. If you want me to be honest, obviously I was a bit skeptical skeptical about the championship, but then I spoke to the gaffer and within a minute of speaking to the gaffer, really my decision had been made for myself. <clears throat> but then um, obviously, you know, you have to talk it through with your family. And then even then just got clarified that it was the right decision to make. Was there a chance of any interest from Premier League club? Yeah, of course, yeah, there was interest, but you know, <clears throat> there was nothing concrete, but there was loads of interest and obviously I'm not a guy that likes to wait around. And uh, like I said to you, when I spoke to the gaffer, it was it was literally within a minute of speaking to him, it was it was done really in my mind. I just had to, you know, speak it over with my family and obviously, obviously sorry, I've got stuff to do, like i.e. I've got a son now, I've got I've got a missus now, so you know, the move for them is, is a big one. So with taking that all in into um into my mind it was I had to speak to them and it was just basically it was done. After speaking to the gaffer it was done really honestly and uh, I spoke to Dixon, I spoke to um Bestie and just them two as well, the way that the club had spoken to them was basically you know, it was the, it was the right way to go. Were you ever tempted to hang on and, and see if a, a Premier League club would, would come Yeah, I could, I could have hanged on. I could have hung on, sorry. And um, I had different options here and there. Not only in England, I had other options abroad as well. Uh, but, like I said to you, the way this club's going forward and the professionalism and the club, and uh, obviously it's difficult times here. It's not, it's not nothing to hide. Everybody knows that, you know, certain people are not getting along. Uh, but... For me, it's all about football, being a part of, for me, hopefully, and for everyone else here, a winning team and doing something I haven't done as well, you know, get promotion to the Premier League it would be unbelievable. You mentioned people not getting along. When you saw that at the weekend about the manager and, and Chevy Singh, did you think again about the move? Nah, you know, listen, I'm, I'm 25, but I've been in this game a long time and I've been in 20 times worse than what it looks like to the media and what it looks like from the outside. So to me, this is it goes on every day. It's just that some you just don't see it on the TV. Um, so for me, it's really just tightening my boots up. And you know what? Let's go Ipswich. <laughs>